So good morning. It is December 26th, day two. I'm sure I'll forget the day before, uh, the day of the week before the end of the uh, trip, but 26th today, day two. Um, this is our first outing, my hunting trip. Camille's coming along. Um, she is not a hunter, so she can't participate, but she's uh, coming out for the first time hunting. I had her in November. Uh, she <laughs> fired a rifle and she really enjoyed it. So ah, she's yes, I did. She did. Uh, <laughs> she's brave enough to come out hunting. So, what's your thoughts on uh, this morning? Well, we'll see how it goes. Um, I think you don't want to actually see plucking the bird after you've taken it, um, but I'm sure you'll get some good game today. Okay, so this is a road that I call boat road. I've hunted it before. I'll show you why once we get further down. It's a great spot for. For birds and uh, rabbit down here as well so uh, um, we'll see what kind of video we can get on uh, day two bye for now Hello. so i wanted to say this is Shh. why you're not allowed to talk i'm supposed to be i thought quiet. that was one of the rules craig we're hunting rabbits okay that's why i have to be quiet <laughs> um this is boat road at least what i call boat road and this is what i call the boat road. old boat kind of in here so everybody I hunt in the area we know this road as as boat road now I was told we're supposed to be quiet so I won't say anything else no snow yet uh, Monday Monday I said Today's Monday, babe. No, no today is today's Saturday. Saturday. But Monday we're supposed to have 10 centimeters, 10 to 15 centimeters of snow. So snow, yeah. there'll be uh, a bit of a change for the terrain for Monday. And uh, tomorrow we're actually in Timmins. So we'll take a drive to Timmins and we're going to be visiting um, one of Camille's cousins that uh, live in Timmins. So we'll get some video of Timmins tomorrow. Um, and we'll continue down this road. I walked off a little bit here just to see because I thought it was a good spot. But uh, you see a couple traps. I have a trap here. It's been here for a little while. A bit rusty, but I don't know that long. There's this one. And they've got a couple actually back here. They've got one more up in the tree right here. Up in the tree right here. But then they've got one here that did get something a, a while ago and obviously something got to it. And there's another trap here that obviously did catch, but then it has the remains attached there. I don't know what else is in there. We've got a possibly we've got a raccoon. Raccoon right down here as well. I'm not sure I don't see anything else. But that's uh that's two traps, two wood traps, the one down there, the one in the tree, and uh, one down below, or well, the two down below. And then there's some remains down here. A fair bit of evidence here actually. Some more remains down here. Right here, a larger animal. I don't know what that is. But then there's some tissue paper. I don't like that. There's someone left tissue paper there. Some more tissue paper in here. Got the two traps. And then these right here. Obviously it's a good uh, good access point right here. Coming down. Quite a bit of evidence.
you the first one I'm using today. A over under 20 gauge um, number six shots, uh, two and three quarter, oh, one ounce, I believe, Federals, and uh, 20 gauge over under. Um, I have modified and improved cylinder. Okay. 